Combo lists allow you to combine different watch lists in TC2000 along with pre-scan conditions, basic conditions that you might always want to see in the stocks you're looking at. Let me show you how to build combo lists. You can start the combo list by clicking the new button and choose combo list. This opens the edit window that allows you to combine both your watch lists and your conditions. Let's name this my universe. Let's add the watch list first. I'm going to click add list and I always use the typing shortcut so we'll grab the NASDAQ stocks. Click add list again to add a second list and we'll add the S&P 500. And then I might like to combine something like ADRs, American Depository Receipts, as part of my combo list. So there are my three different watch lists that we'll be adding. Now I could use the combo list just to combine the watch list. But I also would like to have some pre-scan filter conditions for this particular list. So I'm going to click Add Condition. And I'm going to include a basic price condition. So let's say price between five and a hundred dollars. Now we're eliminating all the stocks that are outside of that price range. I'm going to click add condition again and I'm going to use the 90 day volume, the average volume over the last 90 trading days and I'm going to say I want that to be greater than a half million shares. And then I'll hit add condition one more time type part of the word option because I want to grab the optionable stocks criteria. So now I'm combining the NASDAQ and the S&P 500 stocks, adding in the ADRs, and then I'm filtering those for issues that trade between $5 and $100, have at least a half million shares as their normal minimum trading volume, and I can trade options on them. That will be my universe of stocks. So now I click OK, and I have a watch list of 829 items that meet all of those basic conditions. You can build as many of these combo lists as you want, and once you have a combo list built, you can use that list to sort or scan. For example, I click the scan button, I can apply conditions from my library or create new conditions. Let's just quickly look for stocks with above average volume in our list. We scan for that, and we're down to 115 stocks that live in the source list that I'm using meet my pre-scan conditions as well as the conditions of the scan I've applied. One other quick note, you can access your combo list by clicking on the watch list menu and go to the combo list section. Notice also you can start a combo list by using the little asterisk button which opens the new combo list editor.